Um, so you'll come up to me and I will check off your design. So let's say this one is the good one. So then you're going to get a pair of scissors. So you get a check mark, you get a pair of scissors, you cut out only the design that got the check mark. Once you've cut it out, save your designs. I'm gonna be collecting these and these as well. So once you're done, you're going to get a styrofoam and you're going to write your name and teacher's name in Sharpie. Don't press so hard um, so it leaves an impression. Um, we just wanna lightly, lightly write your name. Then you're going to line it up and get one piece of tape and tape it on. So I've got my tape and I tape it on like a door handle so I can see this and this design. Then I'm going to get a colored pencil, not super sharp, um, not super dull, somewhere in the middle. So this is a good, good kind of point right there. I'm going to trace everything. I'm going to trace the black lines as well as my designs one time. So I'm going to press hard enough to make sure I'm leaving an impression, but not so hard that I am breaking the paper. The reason you use a color pencil is so that way you can see where you have traced and where you need to trace. So when I lift up, I can see the impression. I will need to trace it a second time on the styrofoam to really make sure I have a good impression. Again, not pressing so hard that I'm ripping the styrofoam, but pressing hard enough so that you can really get a clear impression. When you're done, Carefully remove your design. Very careful not to tear. And tape it back. Just like that.